Hi guys, quick video from me today and um, on the back of getting a couple of questions a um, couple of days ago actually and it was regarding how many meals per day should I be having to drop body fat. In fact one of the guys mentioned and this is something that I used to believe in that small frequent meals, maybe six meals a day, will the idea is that it will kickstart your metabolism and you'll drop more body fat and you know there's absolutely no evidence to suggest that this is true but that doesn't mean that you shouldn't have six meals per day or three meals and three snacks per day for some people it's beneficial and for some people it doesn't make any sense at all what i will say is that a lot of the guys that i work with particularly guys that um suffer with a lot of stress, whether it be work stress, not getting enough sleep, and just in general leading very stressful lives, they benefit from small uh, frequent meals because they do get these fluctuations in blood sugar levels. So they're more suited to have three big meals and maybe three snacks or two snacks in between. That would be suited to them. Um, that being said, uh, small frequent meals isn't for everyone. It's not something that suits me. I prefer to have two or three large meals a day. And again, it all really depends on your personal situation, what kind of training plan you follow, what kind of training plan you're following. If your stress levels are high, then yes, perhaps small frequent meals might be best for you. But ultimately, when you're wanting to drop body fat, you need to make sure that 80 to 90% 80 of your foods are coming from good whole sources, nutritious foods and that you're in a calorie deficit okay so you need to be burning off more calories than you're taking in to drop body fat so play around with it uh, see what works with you again it, uh, like a lot of things with health and fitness it's going to be trial and error um, and just see what works for you but it is a myth that six meals per day will kick start your metabolism it's simply not true do what works for you and do what fits your lifestyle and it will fluctuate from time to time depending on your stress levels your sleep and what kind of training plan you're following. Okay, I hope that helped guys. And if you've got any questions, just shoot me a message.